know what that is? I'm gonna solve it. Here we go. to go along with my genius theme I'm going to read some things that are basically you know you're in college when and then there's a list of like 100 200 different things I'm just gonna read a couple see how accurate they are for all you college students out there well, like myself I'm a college sophomore and so far my major's history it might change who knows but as of right now it's history so all you college students listen and see if this is accurate you know you're in college when? High school started before 8 a.m., but now anything before noon is considered early. That's true. I'd complain in 11 o'clock class. I ha yes, very true. I had an 8 a.m. class this past semester. Ridiculous, absolutely ridiculous. This past semester I lived off campus, so I lived at home, which is about a 30 minute or so drive. Um, I had to wake up at like six o'clock, beat the you know morning traffic terrible absolutely terrible so an 8 a.m. class is terrible you have more beer than food in your fridge that for me personally I don't consume alcohol like that so no weekends start on Thursday that's true I didn't have any classes on Fridays and it's going to be the same this next semester. I've already picked my classes. I'll be going to class on Wednesdays and Thursdays. No, just kidding. Mondays and Wednesdays. It's Mondays and Wednesdays. I'm sure about that. <laughs> 6 a.m. is when you go to sleep, not when you wake up. This is only true for, I would say, finals week. I had an easy finals week personal. <laughs> Sounded like a bomb went off. Personally, I had an easy finals week, so that's not true. Your breakfast consists of a Coke or cereal bar on the way to class. Anything with caffeine will do. I myself am a very intense coffee drinker. I'm like a two or three cupper in the mornings. Guzzle it down. It's great. I love it. Um, so coffee is a must in the morning for sure. You start joining clubs because of the free food. <laughs> I, check this out, I went to a meeting for a chess club, that's right, chess, because I'm a nerd, duh, okay, um, okay, confession time, it wasn't just a chess club, that's what they used to, like, mask it, but it was really the wizarding chess from Harry Potter, so it was really like a Harry Potter club, but that kind of was like already taken by people who read the books watch the movies debate characters and stuff more of like a um a debate class or not class club but harry potter themed and this was more like play quidditch in your spare time wizarding you know chess get groups of people together to go to islands of adventure and universal studios in orlando things like that that's kind of more what I'm about. Although, I can argue that Severus Snape was a good man through and through. Besides the point. So that's what I did. And I joined for the butter beer and the treacle fudge that they made. 
It was really good. <laughs> okay, okay. I'm gonna go eat some food. Bye. Okay, so my neighbor just knocked on the door, but I don't wanna answer it. My parents are out, my brother's at work, I'm here. She knocked on my hotel door. I don't even know if she knows what for. There's a little Ed Sheeran, love Ed Sheeran. Whew. Shout out to my hater, sorry that you couldn't save me. Anyways, she knocked on the door. I don't want to do that. I don't want to answer the door. So what I did, <laughs> I used to do it when I was younger, like 10, 11, whatever. Somebody would knock on the door. And, okay, the way my house is set up, it's like, my room's here, and then the kitchen, the front door. So in the kitchen, there's a whole bunch of windows. You can see the front yard, obviously. Okay, whatever. So my room, crawl. Okay, out of my door, crawl underneath the windows. Windows, crawling, underneath. Boom, front door is there. Go up, look in the little peephole, and I see it's the neighbor. So what do I do? I wait and wait. And she stands there for like five minutes, and I wait. She eventually leaves. She knocks twice. She rings the doorbell once. We have three turtle vehicles in my front yard. My car is in the shop, that's why we don't have four. Mom, dad, brother, me, but not me. So, my dad and my mom drove my dad's car. My brother took his. My mom's car is still here. So maybe she thinks someone's home, but no one's home. <laughs> Does that make me mean? Am I bad? What if it was important? I guess I'll never know. Like a, uh, like a Tootsie Pop. How many licks does it take to get to the center? The world may never know. Okay. Fish stick time. So I have these fish sticks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine fish sticks. Heinz ketchup, only way to go. So what I'm gonna do is, this is the only ketchup we have in the house. So I'm going to put a strip of ketchup on each fish stick so that I get a bit of ketchup in every bite so everyone is even. I don't like mustard with my fish sticks. I don't like mustard on anything except for hot dogs. If it's my choice, I won't put it on a burger. Only hot dogs. Hedwig's theme's been stuck in my head for the past couple of days. I'm really wanting to go to the Wizarding World in Orlando. I think I'm going to go soon. So each fish stick has ketchup. I'm guaranteed ketchup in every bite. And I still have some left over. So I'm going to go back into some of the spots that I missed. Alright, good enough for me.